Hi guys, it is a gloomy day here in the end times and uh, I need to get to my ecological meltdown roundup rant. But before I do, this is just my quote of the day. Quote of the day, and, and you're so lucky today because you guys get four quotes of the day. And I want to thank uh, the Climate Reality Project. The Climate Reality Project for sending me four quotes and to start my day with this picture of the four horsemen of the apocalypse, otherwise known as Donald Trump's big oil cabinet. I you know, anybody who does not understand who the four horsemen of the apocalypse, you know, these little ass-licking toadies, uh, working for Donald Trump. Uh, here they are. Thank you, Climate Reality Project, for ruining my morning with, with this goddamn photo. So anyway, we're going to share four quotes from the Four Horsemen of the Apocalypse. First, let's hear from Scott Pruitt, uh, our newest head of the Environmental Protection Agency, who I think it was. Was it Scott, I believe, who just told uh, frackers that they don't need to bother reporting methane leaks. Don't worry about it. Well, we know it's very onerous of you. So what does uh, Scott Pruitt have to say about climate change? <clears throat> Quote, The climate change debate is far from... Settled. Okay, next to Scott, of course, is the number one biggest planet eater on planet Earth. Uh, now our new Secretary of State, that oil man, former CEO of Exxon Mobil, and best friend of Vladimir Putin. I can't believe that Tillerson's escaping all of this Russia shit. So Rex Tillerson, our Secretary of State, weighing in on his opinion of climate change. <clears throat> Quote, Our ability to predict how rising greenhouse gases in the atmosphere are having an effect is very limited. Very limited. Of course, Exxon, Exxon has been predicting it since the 1970s. Now we're going to go over to Horseman of the Apocalypse number three, uh, Ryan Zink, our new, uh, our new Secretary of the Interior, uh, you know, who's responsible for how many millions and millions of acres of our public lands. What is his opinion on climate change? Climate change is not a proven science. But of course, my uh, my favorite quote of all from that all former Texas Republican oil man governor Rick Perry, our brand new energy secretary, a former board member of the Dakota Access Pipeline Company. What does Rick Perry, the uh, new head of our energy department, have to say about climate change? Quote, climate change is one contrived phony mess. Anybody who does not understand what I and uh, the Climate Reality Project and anybody with a brain means when they're talking about Donald Trump's horsemen of the apocalypse, you have just heard from them. And with that, I'm going to wade in to my two-part ecological meltdown roundup rant, the Donald Trump version and the Donald Free version. Bye, guys.